So we're going to start your opponent in deep bad. half. And oh, I want yeah. us to try and keep in mind that every time he has my leg in his guard, that he's turned away for his comfort position, okay? Every time he's looking to make his grip, he's trying to keep everything nice and tight. He's looking out for grips on this arm. He's looking for a Kimura to be pulled away. So what we're gonna do is as we're sitting on top, I'm gonna sit weight down on his shoulder. But when I do, this hand, trying to be uh, as non-imposing as possible, without looking for an underhook, just go by your own leg to here, so it's under his arm. So even if he holds tight, my hand is right here, and now I put my weight on my left hand, and I'm gonna kick my left leg perpendicular to my opponent. So I kick back, so it turns his face. Once his shoulder is flat on this side, this underhook, it's still his arms are strong, so I can't pull it away, so I drop my body on this side, lifting his elbow. Now, my foot is trapped there, so I hold a deep underhook on this arm, I collapse his knees by pulling my legs this way. My other leg comes over the top, out, and now I have a crucifix on his arms here. So I'm keeping this elbow up. Now, all I'm gonna do from here is I go over to here, pull my grips, and now this, this grip on his arms here, I'm gonna rotate my knees up as I pull, getting him into a crucifix. We'll pull it all the way through. And you're either looking for a figure four extending for his arm for the tap or we're going to pull his hand up turn all the way through elbow matches the chin head to here and we're just retracting our elbow okay one more time okay so deep half okay he's in his comfort zone he always needs to be facing this way i need to put this shoulder down and look for the underhook here he's not going to let me pull he's not going to let me get a kimura grip so all I'm doing is I'm putting my hand, tracing my leg through. Put my weight on my hand here. I sit on his shoulder nice and heavy, and then I kick my free leg behind him, 90 degrees, this way. So it turned his chin this way with hip pressure, but I keep this. So keep your elbows tight to here. So this is my position, reach through, and we're here. His knees are to the ceiling, so he's strong. I pull it down, one foot over the top, push, pull, and now we have a crucifix. Right from here, I grab underneath, rotate, pull, get him up nice and high. Go around his arms with a double wrist ride. Figure four, open my knee, get the tap here, hold the wrist, punch this one down, match elbow to chin, four fingers inside the collarbone, retract, and my head pushes. Yeah, I was okay with it. Me too, yeah. I remember you used to, like the Sam and stuff, used to stay very reserved. More grip. Collapse. Push it down. This free hand reaches under. Two one one. Pin. Open the arm. Push down. Match chin.